welcome to this video so continuing to real time cases asked in w interviews the fifth case is how to design donut chart i will cover the donut chart in this video let's move ahead and start w orders table i am using okay here i will show you how to create a donut chart donut chart is nothing but a pie chart within a pie chart okay let's start building up donut chart okay i will pull this region into the color shell okay now i will drag these cells into the rows i will go to the show me section and here you will see this pie chart so i will click on that i can see the pie chart is getting created here i want this uh, as a big so i will go to this standard uh fit with here i will select entire view you will see the pie chart is created here okay now what i will do i have number of records in the major shell right click on that number of records go to default properties and click on aggregation and change this aggregation from sum to whatever you want that is i want it as a average average sales i want to find so i will click on the average okay now drag this number of record fill into the row shell again drag this number of records into the row shell you can see the two pie charts are created here that is you will see this two pie charts but this two pie charts are not on the middle of the chart okay now right double click on this number of this axis you will see this include zero here just uncheck this and see what happens this pie chart is now aligned to this axis as one now again double click on this number of records uncheck this include zero the same i will do okay you can see these two charts are now at the correct position now i will remove this region from the color shell okay you can see the color get, gets changed i will change the now in the first gra uh, first chart i will remove the size uh, i will remove the sales from size shell okay and i will change the size of this okay now i can click on dual axis you can see the two two charts the two pie charts created are overlapping each other you can see okay now i will change the color of this inner chart as white as our background color is white okay now first first of all i will synchronize the axis and i will remove the header that axis are showing here okay you can see the donut chart is created now what i will do i want some labels i want to see the region and the respective sales here i will add everything into the label i will i want total sales in in the inner chart i will drag this sales into the labels of inner okay the donut chart is created very well now you can see the donut chart here now in the next session i will discuss about the waterfall chart and how to design it what are the applications of waterfall chart we will discuss in our next video if you think this video is really helpful for you please like and subscribe my video and click on the bell icon so that you will get updated when i upload my next video thank you for watching